Hello the morning to you ladies, my name is Jack Guy. and welcome back to Crush Bandicoot! We're going into the last area, we have only Cortex left to fight, and we are gonna kick his ass! The only thing is... Oh, God, tomorrow, you're not a bad level, but in this, it's another bike level. And the bike levels... They pain me. They hurt me, deep, dark, down inside my soul. Uh, okay, but we have a brand spanking new buddy old boy to deal with here. Oh god, the lag in that. Padoosh! And when you kill them, it doesn't even cost a wumpa fruit! When I was younger and I played this, I thought that when you collected a wumpa fruit, that you had to shoot the actual wumpa fruit that you had. Like, you had to collect a lot of them, and that's how you kill the enemies. Look at this big bad motherfucker. This guy's scary. This guy fires b bullets at you. There we go. I don't know why he does that. I don't know why he turns his arse to you when you get close. Like, the oh no, my one weakness. I think he's just into butt stuff. Haha! <laughs> oh god, crash! You're gonna make me crash and burn! I can't hit him from here though. I can hit him all I want. But he doesn't do anything! Aku Aku! Go! Aku don't give him shit. Well then! Sorry Aku Aku, but you're dead now. And then hit all the boxes. God, controlling this is so slow! Get it? Oh! Nailed it! Wait for it! Yep! Uh -huh. Yes! That's what it's all about. Can I hit that crate all the way down here, there from here? <laughs> no! I want to keep them. I need all my lives. How else am I going to get a grip? The other one's over here. See? Judicial use of the bazooka. I was like, where the hell is the other one? There we go. Wait, what? Is there more shit up top? Can the camera move and pan up there? Where's the last one? Uh. Shit, man! I guess it's not here! Well, it probably is, and I just missed it. No, oh, be careful there, crashy boy! Don't do anything brash, Crash! It's a play on words. It's a beautiful play on words. It's the best play on words. It's it's lovely. This is a very nice looking level. They don't make platformers like they used to, do they? Actually, they do. It's called Shovel Knight. <laughs> Peace! Up and over we go! Yeah! Screw you. I was taking a lot of spin classes. That's how I'm able to do all those moves. Hup. No. Get the Wumpers! Fire them all! Sad. Wait, where's the thing for this? Don't hit it. Okay. Oh, I didn't yell fire in the hole. Am I even Jacksepticeye anymore? I don't think so. Peace. See you later. Bye. See, now this becomes really fucking handy. But I want to do this first. Boo. Fire in the hole! Bip, bip, dip, dip, bip. Okay, be smart about this. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah! They don't explode as nicely as the TNT does, but you think they would because they're technically stronger. They're the insta-booms! You can't even touch them, or they'll explode! 
What kind of volatile mess is that stuff? Alrighty. Moving on up. Bye. Shit. Oh, I can still get it. Haha! -ha! And also. Haha! -ha! Yeah, I can't finish the level fully anyway. Oh, see, that's what I thought they did if I jumped on them. Was it only with the thing? I can't remember that. I could have sworn I remembered that when you actually jumped on them, they did that flip and then you had to hit them again. Who knows? Maybe I'm just crazy. I am 27 after all. It was... I was 8 when I played this. It's been quite a fucking while. That's actually nuts to think about. Because you always... You always think like, oh, I wonder if I can remember anything from my childhood. And you're like, nah, it was, it was so long ago. How would I remember anything from that? But I guess video games count. See, I have to wait. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I fucked it up. This is the end of the level as well. Ah, go, go, go. Fuck yeah. How many did I miss? Aw. I probably could have got them all. Like Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. I'll do it though. I don't need them to kill Cortex. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna straight up murder him. I'm gonna sneak into his house. Grab him by his big old yellow head. And I'm just gonna pull. <laughs> Until life leaves his body. <laughs> That's kind of messed up. Don't be. Don't be. Don't be. No. Oh, beans. Landing from a jump will cancel your boost. Yes, I know. But sometimes it's good to cancel my boost because sometimes I mess it up. And the boost is really freaking hard to control. Uh, okay, first try. Watch this. I got the mechanics down now. Ah, oh, fucking moving cops. Beep, beep. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Yes. Ah, get off the fucking road, Granny! Do I have El Road Rage? Turn, 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 turn. Ah, the boy, crash! I'm in fourth! Hell yeah! Okay, turn, Jesus Christ. Just lean your body, crash! It's not that hard! Motherfuckers. Yeah, drive those bastards off the road. Not me though, not me! I'm a nice boy, I mean well! Oh, if I crashed through that, I would've got it. Crash! Don't live up to your name now! Please? Oh, will I get it? Will I get it? Oh, fuck. Fuck! That's after completely messing me up. Now I'm gonna fail the level because of that. Shit balls! Turn! <laughs> I hate it. I fucking hate it. I hate it. It's so obnoxious. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. We can still do this. We can still do this. We got this. End of the road is not in sight yet. Damn it! It was a boost there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jesus Christ. How in the blue balls am I supposed to keep in contact with that? I can still fucking do this, boys! Boop, boop, ba doodle doo not if I fucking drive like that. Okay, this is the very end. You go over all the ramps. You get ramps. You get boosts. You get more ramps. You get more boosts. Oh, wow! The fucking hardest one, and I did it first try. He drove over it. I'm gonna claim insurance off that bastard. Oh, thank God. That was a level I was really worried about. That was a level I thought was gonna raise my blood pressure so high, my head was gonna pop like a big old tomato. But we're good. We're golden. Oh. <laughs> Aku Aku, I'm sick of looking at your face. It's a shame about the load times in this game. For something running on a PS4 Pro, I feel like that the the load times should be a bit faster than they are. Ooh, flaming passion. I think we get one more plane level before the end as well. I like those levels. I didn't when I was young because I... Well, now I have a, a, a repertoire of games under my belt, but back then... Plane controls were like such a new thing to me. I had no idea how to control a plane in a video game. I was eight, okay? It was a different time. 
You have to remember that when I was eight years old, the internet wasn't really a thing yet. I mean, it was, was it? When did the internet become like a mainstream thing for people to actually be able to do? Like, this was in the age of dial-up internet. Where it was basically the same as calling a family in 14 different countries and asking them could they hook up the internet. I know, terrible analogy, but shut up! Or I'll hit you like that monkey! Huh. Um... So yeah. It, it was a very- it was a much, much simpler time. Okay. You know what, this is happening. <laughs> what the fuck? Did that just collapse the whole fucking section of his house? Oh, Jesus Christ, you scared me there. That was insane! Fire in the hole! There we go. That's a nice lighting effect. Ah, oh, get the crystal. Hup. These levels are nice, because it's a nice mix between, like, forward and sideways platforming. It, like, marries the old 2D style with the new 3D stuff. You literally just collapsed a whole section of his house. <laughs> Before, they used to just vanish. Now you literally kill a bunch of them. You kill like a whole family inside that house. Fire in the hall! Yeah, swing your fucking sword elsewhere, bitch. Okay. Now this is happening. Come on, Crash! That's enough for you to get up. You're messing with me. I missed! God damn it. The timing's all off. Got him! He didn't even get his bomb off. What the fuck? <laughs> the fucking sound. Not even a flinch. Oh, crash. Oh my god, that was hilarious. <laughs> Not even a flinch on him. He just smashed his whole face into the ground and then just went off again. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry, buddy. Oh, this one has a death symbol on it. I don't like that. I don't need that much death in my video games. Unless it's my enemies. How was I supposed to know? Do I start back in the... Oh, 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 oh. Whatever. What's up, bro? Smile for the Wumpas! Okay, I'm gonna try not spend as much time on this fucker this time. There we go. Yeah! Okay. Gotta be safe about this, this time. I wonder how many people that drives insane as well. When I don't pick up that one Wumpa fruit or something, I just walk off and everyone's like, Oh, please just pick it up! It's like when you see somebody play Sonic and they don't collect all the rings, you're like, What are you doing to me? Get out of here, bro! <laughs> it's so funny. I thought they were just like closing shutters. But it actually looks like a whole section of their house collapses. Like there's brick and scaffolding and everything. Dude, a checkpoint in a bonus level. Damn. That's why I knew it as well. I even clicked double jump, but I didn't have enough time to get it off. Uh-oh. Haha! <laughs> now I'm behind you! Jack Hughes! Oh, shit. There is another one! Don't send your bomb there, Crash! Okay, there's none this time. <laughs> I should have known those sneaky bastards. Huh. That did not go as according to plan. Come on, Crash! God, all this flipping and falling and fucking non stopping. Can you just double jump for me? There we go. There we 
There we go. Now I don't need to worry about Captain Underpants. I give up. I was going to drop my controller, but then I realized it would have just smashed into my desk. Fuck that guy. I hate him. I hate him. Now I'm taking my time with this. Get him. Here we go. So I don't have to waste my time with that again. See? It's fucking delayed. Oh. That was a green gem one! That's why there's a checkpoint. It wasn't just a bonus station. That's why it has a death symbol on it. Nice one! My first color gem in the playthrough. Feeling good about myself now. Let self-esteem raise for a little bit. He's like fucking cunt bandicoots. Oh, my wampers! That gets me anyway? Are you fucking shitting me? The checkpoint stays in the fucking bonus level? What kind of horse shit is that? At least give me one when I leave the fucking bonus area. Oh my god, that's bullshit. Okay. I mean, I didn't have that far to go, but Jesus, I lost my Oobtagon. What am I going to do when I'm a little Ubi? Jump to your death, Crash. Oh, I can't jump. I wanted to jump and do my body slam and see what happened. Because I thought you could hit that guy if you were behind him, but I guess as long as he's swinging his sword, you can't do anything to him. There we go. Like, there should be just a checkpoint right here. Oh, wait. I didn't even have to go that way. We're going this way. I think. Back away. Oh, thank God. I thought I was actually going to die. I thought I messed up the timing of it. Boing. Hey, here's the bonus area. Wipe that sweat from your brow, y'all. The end of the level's right up there. I can see it. I've got you in my sights. See, now you have to actually use your bazooka to destroy these because I don't think there's any green box at the end to destroy all the nitro because there's only nitro in the bonus stage. And I actually think all the boxes in... Oh, no, never mind. I was going to say, I think all the boxes in this bonus area are just nitro boxes. Okay. As they said, it doesn't cost lives. You might as well keep trying it. Hey, there's another platform right there. But oh, that's the end of the level. See, these ones are cool. Some of the ones in the first levels, like the very first levels, you actually go into a loading screen and go somewhere else. But this just has it off in a section outside the play area. That's really cool. Okay, I can do that. <laughs> oh, is that going to explode me from here? I got very lucky with that. Yeah! Oh, no. Okay, I have to destroy all these boxes. I tried to do a jumping up, but his head hit the thing! I have to destroy all those boxes with my bazooka on the way back. I guess I could destroy them on the way forward. Okay, don't spin. Get all your spinning out here. Okay, good. Good boy. Now he's not going to spin anymore. That's him done. I hate how slow it is to control that thing. Let's just do this. Okay. I love doing that. I love destroying shit tons of boxes. Let's just fucking do this. And make sure we can actually make it over. And then destroy them all. No? What? 
Here we go. I've given up. There we go. Now I can't mess it up. There we go. There we go. Please give me an extra life for that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't think I got all the boxes. There we go. I think I might have missed a couple. Damn. Wait, what did you lock on to? Hey, I hit him. <laughs> I didn't even see him. 74 out of 75. That sucks. I tried so hard. Man, there might have been one box I missed when I went into the secret area. Because I had to go back. I, I don't know. There's a lot of crazy things happening in the world today. <sighs> Only two levels to go though, right? And I got a green gem. So technically... Jesus, what else is inside your head? Technically I got a gem. It wasn't the one we thought we were going to get. I could have got three things in one round. That would have been amazing. Everyone would have been happy about me then. Mad bombers. This is Crash's one. Crash gets to be in the plane this time. Crash, Coco, remember, it is not only Dr. Cortex that we battle. Beware of Uka Uka, my children. He is a far more dangerous enemy than anyone can imagine. Yeah, you should know. He's your brother. Um, I like that his name is Aku as well. Aku Aku. Because he reminds me of Aku from Samurai Jack. Shoot down the bombers! Hi, Crash! Okay, these ones are a bit harder because you have to shoot down the engines. So you have to shoot both engines before the whole thing goes down. Damn it, man! Oh, I'm hurting. Oh, I'm hurting. There's one bomber down. Okay, we need to get some health. Fuck you guys! Mother of Christ! Okay, maybe it was this level that I remember being really fucking hard. Here we go. No, you don't. Come on. If I shoot those fuckers as they're coming in, it won't be that bad. Come on, get him! Really? Really? Fuck. Okay, give me some health. Here we go. Where's this motherfucker going? Can I fly faster, please? Okay, don't have to worry about those guys now. Now destroy this. Never stop shooting. Keep shooting, Crash! There you go. Now these ones over here are weak already. Fuck you! Fuck you! Ah, some of those should have got him. One engine down. Mayday! Mayday! Going down in the mountains! Those guys are just straight up dead. I just straight up killed those guys in those planes. It's like the war all over again. Yes! Nice. Be great if I could fly faster after this motherfucker. Ah, come on, that should have hit him. Can I do a loop? No. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him. Ow. Oh, I did it! Oh! Is there six of them? Hmm. Time trial in those levels is kind of hard because you don't know which ones to go for first. And if you miss some of your shots, it really messes you up. But then again, that's kind of everything in time trial modes. It's all about the time. I think we have another future level left to go and then we're done. <laughs> Shouldn't be fucking eating them, Crash. Oh no, bug light! This is it.
The very last level is the one that's in the dark. Unlock a new path by earning all of the colored gems. Why would you unlock a new path by... Leaving me alone? Unlock the path of... Not bothering me. Come here, snake! A snicky, snicky snake! Now we have the crocodiles doing their shit, but I can just do that now. <laughs> oh, it's so easy! Yeah, so is this the level where we have to get the, the nightlight bug? There you go. Channel your inner, Mar inner Mario. I know I just got rid of all my Wumpas, but we're fine. Yeah, here it is. But see... This section before... When I played it when I was younger, there was no such thing as brightness. Well, there was. <laughs> Not what I mean, because the bug runs out after a while. So this this section is timed. If you if you lose the bug, then you don't know where the fuck you're going. So if you want to get all the boxes, you kind of have to be fast about it. Okay, screw the wumpas. But yeah, I wonder if I could just up the brightness of the screen or the TV or um the game itself. And would I be able to see things? Ah, here we go. Yes! Invincible! Come on, me bitches! What you got? So it definitely gives you three there. You have to get three Oobdegons there. Yes. Yes. Finish strong, Crash. Finish strong. Okay. So now, I actually only need one more Oobdegon, and we're good to go. Yeah, I don't think the original game worked like that. I think once you ran out of three, you had to get three again. And there was usually, like, three per level. For some levels. So you had the chance of always getting an Oobdegon. <laughs> I keep calling them that. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's do this. Speed, speed, speed. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's just do this. I lost him. Will this kill me? Nope. Okay, did I miss any boxes? No. Okay. We're in the fucking dark on this one. Oh! I'm so close. Can I hit them from here? Okay. I have fucking no idea where I am. Let's see if I can cheat this. <laughs> Options. Oh fuck. I couldn't see. There was wumpa fruit there though. I thought, well, if there's wumpa fruit there, I must be able to land on it. Okay, let's just try it again. It'd be faster though. How the fuck are you supposed to be able to do the the bouncy ones fast? I guess with the bazooka, but now I lost my ruby guns. Oh, I just fell. Oh no! I was I almost did it last time. Shit! Can you just follow me back? Because the rest is easy. I just need to destroy these. Cool. 40 out of 40. Nice. I even tried that like, like when I died. I tried just jumping and spinning to the end. Oh man. Oh well. 34 lives. That's a good number of lives. That's nice. You don't normally get lives in games anymore. It's all about just checkpoints and everything, which I guess makes sense. Because the life system was kind of an old... It's kind of an old archaic, like... Uh, what would I call it? Arcade machine type of thing. Because it was, to, it was to make you spend more coins. 
Okay, fuck the wumpa fruit. We don't care about the wumpa fruit. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! I fucking did it. Yeah! Finishing off strong! Last level, and I got a gem. Happy about that one. That went really well. Because sometimes it's like, oh, you try so hard and you come back to do the levels again and you try the bonus area again and then you get to the end and it didn't matter because you missed one tiny box somewhere or you didn't get all the things anyway. Okay, final boss. Wait, there was another gem in there? Oh yeah, there was a platform I couldn't go on. Whoa, 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 yeah. get him crash, get him crash. At least I didn't add him dabbing or something like that in the game. Okay, here we go. Dr. Neo Cortex. Y'all ready? High five. Yeah. <laughs> you laughing. At? I'm sorry. This is the part where I'm supposed to be angry, full of rage, incensed beyond belief. Once again, you have outsmarted and outspun my best henchman. <laughs> Uka Uka's like, bitch, upset, what? Shouldn't I? And in fact, we're furious. But it seems we're all up one small detail, you little orange delivery boy. <laughs> now that you have gathered all the crystals, all we have to do is take them from you. <laughs> also, why does he have to fly across his face to talk to you? When at the beginning, he just talks to... He just talks to Cortex normally, and... Other times he- it doesn't matter, and Aku Aku doesn't need to do that to you? Okay, I forget what this is like. I know Uka Uka and Aku Aku fight in the middle of the place. And I have to dodge these guys in the middle of everything. So there's like two things I have to dodge. I have to dodge Cortex and I have to dodge the dudes in the middle. And then his shield goes down... whatever. Oh, yeah, he throws mines. Got him! And then I have to spin him into the middle. <laughs> okay! The music for this boss fight, though, is really fucking good. You should go listen up to the original one. Because he'd be dead there, but Uka Uka keeps bringing him back. And now these guys do a different fight each time. Which direction are you going? You're going over there, okay. It's like a fucking resource management game. There's so much shit that you have to take into consideration. Man, I remember this being so hard when I was young. Okay. Now into the fucking pit of death you go. No, go that way! Oh, thank God. If you wait too long, then he just gets back up. Do, 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 do. Okay, last one. Is this where you guys, like, collide? Ah. And then you explode, yeah, so I have to be careful of that. Fuck. Okay, so just don't be near them. Don't be near them and you're fine. Ugh. Now do your mines. Fuck. Yes! Last time, bitch! Last time! Down the hole you go! Yeah! Fucking did it! I can sprint! Woo! Just jump down in the hole after him. There you have it! So there's only one boss I actually died on! Defeated again! This is not fair! Maybe I should retire to a nice big beach with a nice big drink and a woman with nice big bags of ice for my head. <laughs> it's not over, Bandicoot. There are still the gems. We still have a chance to triumph. <laughs> I like that. I like that they actually call attention to the gems, which makes you like go back and do it again. Fucking good shit! Man, for you guys it's a bit different because you watched it all like as a series, but for me, I've just been playing this like non-stop. I recorded all five videos 
like one after another, kind of. So this just flew by for me. It's a lot shorter than I remember it being. Oh, very, very, very nice job on the remaster. I mean, some parts of it were a little clunky, but I don't know if that's because I'm recording with my capture card, which always adds like the slightest bit of lag to everything. And for a lot of games, you don't notice it. But when you're recording a game that needs precision, like if I was to record a first-person shooty, shooty, first-person shooter on this, or to record something like a platformer, you kind of need the stuff to be responsive. But that's more a case on my end than the actual than the actual remaster. But yeah, some of the stuff like the double jump feels a little inconsistent. The controls on the the non-platforming levels were still kind of shit, but they were always kind of cumbersome anyway. Um, there was just a lot of deaths that I feel like weren't my fault. Some of them were, some of them were just silly of me, like jumping down when the dudes threw the swords and then I didn't know it was there and- or messed up the timing of it. But other ones it felt like I should have made the jump and then I double jumped and he didn't make it anyway. So, other than that, absolutely love this. This was so much fun to do. Such a blast from the past as well, to go back and play all these levels again and remind myself of when I was younger. Like that whole last world area? It was an area that me and Glaive were doing together, and then I went to school and came back and he had the game beaten. And then he was like, oh no, we can just do it again and I'll show you. And I was so pissed off and sad, but at the same time I just wanted to see what it was like. So, we just played it again anyway, plus we had to get all the gems. So we went back and tried to collect everything ourselves. And then I tried some of the... <laughs> I tried some of the time trial modes then. We should actually try that now. Okay, we can actually skip these. We should try a time trial mode on like the very first level and just fucking blast through it now because now I have sprint Which makes things infinitely easier Because sprint is like what you're well you can do the time trials without the sprint, but sprint is kind of what It's designed for it's for the time trials Yeah, usually there's like statistics or something up there interact Do you want to leave her here? No, I want to bring Coco with me. She's with me always and forever. Oh wait, I can't sprint in here then because R2 is the thing. You know what, Coco? We'll give you a chance to do this. We'll give you a chance to do the time trial. So time trial, I'm not killing any enemies. Crash. Coco, if you have already retrieved a level's crystal, then you will find a floating clock when you- Lame, I know. There's a floating clock now at the start of the level, so that's how you trigger the time trial. Um. So you, it, it doesn't count exactly when you start getting in, you actually have to trigger it by this clock here on the right. So, I've never seen your run animation. Look at you go! Nice! Okay, let's do this. So I'm not killing anybody. I'm not doing anything like that. I'm just literally running through the level as fast as I can. Boo, 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 doo, doo, boo. I collect you just in case. Oh yeah, and there's boxes that you can collect to add to your time! Ah! So anything that gets in my way, I'll kill. That made sense. Okay, let's go. If I can get three of them, then I'll definitely power through the fucking level. Nice! Nice, Coco! Coco, you loco! Oh, perfect timing. Look at this shit! Look at this speed run! Have you ever seen such shit like this before? Game fact. Okay, what's the platinum? I did it, what did I get? Gold? Oh, I did your initials. Nice. <laughs> oh, I used to do that when I was younger as well. <laughs> oh, so good. I think I might have entered in bum or something though. Not ass. I should see how many letters it allows me to put in. Well, before it was like, didn't a little flip panel thing come up that you had to hit? What the fuck is the the platinum time on that? There's like another tier above that. There's like a platinum one that you can get. Gold is like the highest in the <laughs> gold, bronze, silver all kind of category, obviously, but there's also platinum. Well, that does it for this series on Crash Bandicoot. Again, for me, it's weird because the series is already over and it's only been a couple of hours since I started playing it, so that's kind of sad in a way. But I, ho I really hope you guys enjoyed this. 
I've absolutely no idea because none of the episodes have gone up by the time I've played the last episode But I kind of just wanted to go through the whole thing anyway Regardless of anything else Just just for me More than anything because I wanted to play this game again And as I said it really means a lot to me and I, I really love the Crash Bandicoot games I, Oh man I really wish they'd remaster like Crash Team Racing or Crash Bash Like the multiplayer ones because Crash Bash was like a, a Mario party Crash Team Racing then was the Mario 60 or the Mario Kart 64 kind of game. I mean Crash Bandicoot is just a rip-off of Mario. Let's face it. That's that's all it's ever been. It, it was their answer to Mario's platforming and Mario's like go-kart racing adventures and Mario's Mario Party adventures, so I would just really love to be able to play them again. Who knows? I might even try and get a copy of it in town because there's a CEX in town that should have like old versions of games. Maybe I can find an old Crash Team Racing Disc on eBay or something and I'll, I'll get an emulator then and be able to play it um, That way it's legal Because <laughs> um, that would be fun crash team racing. I Think I actually might have played more than this me and my friend had it My friend was really good at it because he was the one who was really good at all the boosting and he knew all the shortcuts and everything and I Actually no, I did play this more because as I, I remember this game far more fondly but crash team racing I barely remember that game and I would love to play it again. A Crash Bash then was super fun because it was multiplayer. I think, was it? Well, there was more characters on screen at once and it was like you fighting over like objectives and shit and there was just little fun party games in it. So I'd love to see those be remastered. Um, I don't know if people want to see me collect all the gems or anything. I don't think that would be as fun as going through the story the first time and defeating all the bosses because you don't have to defeat the bosses this time and it would just be a case of Bouncing from level to level it would be too much like chopped up editing just going through levels and collecting all the boxes and stuff So I don't think it would be as fun to do as the main series So I might just leave it here and we'll see what happens from now, but for now Thank you guys so much for watching it if you liked it punch the like button in the face like a boss and Hey face on the road whoosh, whoosh. Thank you guys and I will see all you dudes okay. This is cool. I'm glad I get to play games from my childhood for a lot of people. Thank you for being here and letting me be able to do this.